What's up everyone? It's Vincenzo here, bringing y'all some more legend stuff, and I have a little bit of a treat, sort of. <laughs> um, I'm actually playing against my wife right now. Uh, I am going to do some grinding on the ladder since the season just reset, but my wife just called me, and she was like, Hey, I want to I wanna play a game with you, and I told her I was about to start recording right when she was about to call me. I had my buttons on the record. But, um, yeah, so I kind of picked just a random deck, like an old one, because my wife doesn't play this game as much as I do. So, <laughs> really on, on my first draw. So it wouldn't be fair to go up against her with something that I actually could use to grind the ladder, because I would just probably completely blow her out. And, um... If this is the deck that I think she's running, yeah, the really real aggro. You've got to go through him Greed. first. Well met, Marsh friend. Look at my wife; she's being nice to me. <laughs> okay. And also, welcome the Dragon Invader. I think I just added this guy um, from Schwartz's channel, his uh, Discord server, I should say. So he's uh, getting to watch some. Um, <laughs> he's getting to watch me and my I'll wife fight. I was gonna make a, a bad, distasteful joke, but I probably shouldn't. Let's see, this guy's kind of scary. Interesting. Now, this deck I'm using, it's like a, uh, <laughs> it has all my, um, favorite, like, Daedra that aren't invade. That's, uh, what the theme is here. Now, I probably should have uh, traded here. Yeah. That kind of sucks. Wow, yikes. All right. I'm about to get destroyed by my wife who's played this game like twice in the past like three months. Let me kill for you. Okay, that's pretty bad. Uh, but I think I can hold down until turn uh, 12 because I don't think she's going to have an answer for an Iron Outer Knock. And Shrine Guardian might be good because I'm, I'm pretty sure she's going to have some charge in here. Actually, Dark Seducer could be good. My friend would like to say hello. Yeah, we're gonna get rid of her her javelins. Apologies. <laughs> that that's me saying sorry because I know she's on the other other end getting Increasing. pissed off. <laughs> yeah, she's going for it. It's actually pretty bad that she got uh all the cards that just kind of burn damage down. 
Like, that's actually really good for her, but bad for me. The Legion stands ready. All right, we're just gonna take care of this to get some health. Foul breath in between. Alright, so we got some drain, we got some big damage coming down. I mean, we can knock down half of her health right now. <laughs> never mind. Or so I thought. A taste of Lord How? Walk with our Lord. Alright, we're turning it around. Your blood stands A taste of Lord Ooh. Uh, what is she gonna have? Alright, we're just gonna do that just to kind of be rude. <laughs> just to be like, yeah, you still can't, you can't do much now. Now, if I'm correct, I'm pretty sure she only has two Manticoras. Like, she only owns two of them. So, we're going to throw him down. Oh, you better have a way to do six damage. Yeah, you're gonna no. Oh, that's not enough though. An unfortunate mistake. Yeah, you you were gonna have to wait to do that. Beware, you swim in troubled waters. <laughs> Remin is only the first step on my path to greatness. Prepare to die. <laughs> it's just my wife, guys. I'm not being rude. <laughs> we should talk each other all the time. Come and warm yourself. Okay. <laughs> Imagine if she has all three of them. Okay, nice. Nice. Let's do don't, no, don't do it again. Don't do it again. No! <laughs> uh, he has regenerate. Oh, okay. She knew what she was doing. <laughs> Nicely done. I My thanks is yours. On their marrow. All right. Shrine Guardian should just kind of finish it. The Legion stands ready. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, all right. She's uh, she's doing some pretty cool stuff. All right, this has to be it. Imagine my wife has like a Dawn's Wrath. <laughs> Alright. By the aid of 
We're gonna give her a chance. Shit, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> Alright. Everyone give my wife a round of applause because she, she did some cool stuff there for someone who doesn't play very often. Alright, actually my wife is uh, re rematching me. Uh, but I'm going to do something different. I'm going to use... I'm going to use the Skelly Boys because I haven't... I don't think I've featured them on this uh, channel yet. But it's my... Um, I have uh, sent videos of it to uh, Schward and I'm pretty sure he's uploaded them before. But it's kind of like a skeleton token deck. Spawns a bunch of little skeletons. And the other ones, the bigger skeletons, buff them up. And then there's, I mean, like Bone Colossus gives friendly skeletons plus one, plus one. Uh, Divine Fervor. Uh, excuse me. There's Divine Fervor. There's also Training Grounds. Uh, and only like four creatures in the entire deck are not skeletons so like it's pretty much always gonna proc more so if you've played uh the other two ones the uh onde clan sorcerer and the other one is the uh purple one one guy that uh i think it's the last gasp just gives something in your hand plus one plus one so they kind of have some good synergy with this, especially with the amount of uh, stuff that you can just kind of sp spam out on your field. Now I don't exactly remember what this deck is, but I'll probably just play it a little slow. And uh, we'll do training grounds next, because. I don't think she has any Dushniks, or I know she doesn't have Belligerent Giants because she doesn't own any of the stories, and she probably has a couple Edicts of Azura. Alright, and this is where we start kind of uh, cooking a little bit, because like now this, now this one one becomes a two, the this one one becomes a two two. That then also summons a 2 2 when he dies. Oh, wow. Prepare to die. <laughs> Beware, you swim in troubled waters. Uh, we'll do another uh, skin pound. I don't know what, what she's playing. I'm not sure if this is like a uh, kind of control deck or not. The shall heal you. It might be. You won't escape. You won't escape. Alright, we're gonna leave it there. I actually probably should have just played her in this lane. So that way I could do my my bone daddy. Uh at the end of my turn. Damn. Yeah, she's she's doing a pretty good job clearing the board. She has uh, definitely improved. You will feed my clan. I'm uh, I'm gonna leave it. I'm just gonna see what she does. I'm gonna give her a chance to actually play something and keep it.
Also, some uh, interesting news for anyone who does care. Oh, <laughs> well then. Uh, yeah, interesting news for anyone who does care. Uh, I am starting a Discord server and um, also a Facebook page, which <laughs> I actually already had the Facebook page because I made one when I was in high school, like 10 years ago. And, uh, wow, rude. Um, and it, it like, I, I would post, like, the occasional meme on this group, and it would get, like, you know, three likes or whatever. <laughs> but apparently there's, like, 2,000 people following that page, so I was like, let me just go ahead and slap this, uh, YouTube channel onto it and rename it that and see how it goes. So I will uh, probably link those in uh, the description for this video. Alright, well that's seven damage between the two of them. Alright, well she wasn't going to be able to use that anyway. Her getting rid of the, um, the training grounds actually did really hurt a lot. Ooh, don't don't have one more damage. Okay. I'm I'm kind of fine with this staying alive. It, it can punch me a little bit. Now this can be I think the other Bone Colossus would be great. Let's see what she's got for that. That gives plus two, so... I think the double Bone Colossus is going to be too much. That's... That would be 6, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Ah. <laughs> Alright, well, she bought herself one more turn. Damn. Alright, that was pretty good. I'll give her that one. That was pretty good. Hopefully she plays something that Ancestral Dead can uh, take out. Man, I love the premium art on this uh, Bone Colossus. This looks... Now, see how an orc lord you know what? I'm going to let her keep that. <laughs> She can have it. I'm gonna let her get some insane value and try to turn this around. If she can do it in one turn. I hope she didn't get busy at work. Okay. Oof. I think she wanted to attack with... Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she wanted to attack with the uh, other guy first. Alright. The watch is mine. This fucking this guy. <laughs> 
see what I would have done is I would have given this guy the plus two. You swim in deep waters. That's at least what I would have done. Yeah, that buys her another turn. I'm not going to be rude with the, uh, whatchamacallit, the, uh, removal. It's my wife, after all. I'm just going to play good cards and see how she handles it. Of course. <laughs> what does she get? Alright, <laughs> she buys herself another turn. I'm ready for anything. Yeah, she'll yeah, she'll be able to clear most of this. I love the premium art on this guy too. Which speaking of which, in about a month, um me and my wife will be having our first kid, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to play Legends that much. I was thinking about um, playing some kind of game where I don't have to be like sitting at it the whole time because there's someone on the other end, so something single player. Oh god, does she have it? Dude. Oh, she messed up. I think she could have had it there. I'll clear a path. You could have three, four, five. I I would have been it would have been close. Oh wait, I should have um Another good game with my wife. She actually almost had me there. I think she could have gotten me down to like one health. So, for real this time, everyone give my wife a round of applause because those were fun games. All right, let me finish the uh, housekeeping stuff, so to speak, before uh, that game with me and my wife ended. But yeah, so like in a month, uh, we're gonna be having a kid. He'll be born. And, um, so as you can imagine, it's probably a hor hard to record, uh, videos when there's potential for a baby crying in the background. Don't want you guys to hear that. Uh, and I also don't want to be recording playing against someone. And then all of a sudden I have to concede because I have to take care of my baby. Uh, so I'm thinking about probably playing an RPG or something, uh, cause I've always wanted to do YouTube, actually, and um, uh, I'm just kind of glad that this game I'm like, you know, Legends I'm pretty good with. Uh, at least I like to think I'm pretty decent at this game and can provide some good commentary sometimes. And uh, having a baby doesn't really, it, it can and it can't work out very well. Like I said, I don't want to concede on people randomly. But I'm probably going to play something like Oblivion. And I also danced around the idea of playing um, Divinity Original Sin 2. But me and Schwartz are still playing that. Uh, we're still playing the first one. And I think the general consensus is that we probably... I think he wants to play the second one when we're done. Uh, after we take a little bit, little bit of a break from the first one. Because uh, <laughs> we're like... 18 19 hours into it right now and we're still like very early into it um so i kind of want to maybe hold off on that maybe wait until we start playing that one or if we finish it or something so it'll probably be oblivion but if there's any other rpg that 
anyone that's watching is interested in me trying out or if I already own it uh, you know I'm down to make uh, content for it I like uh, playing games blind too and kind of figuring them out so you know that's that's all that's an idea I just wanted to warn you guys I'll remind y'all in a few weeks <laughs> um, that that's gonna happen in case I haven't gotten any suggestions uh, at that time but just a little bit of a forewarning um, hold on I'm gonna need a drink that's a lot of talking Alright, so right now, I have a uh, quest to win uh, five games with Empire. And uh, let me show off the deck really quickly. I've also still been forgetting to put the uh, deck list in the description, so let me just go ahead and do that so I don't forget. So, uh, I usually see Control Empire and... I don't necessarily hate control, but I hate playing it a lot. Um, I feel like there's a lot of gen generally there's like a lot of greedy control, and I kind of can't stand them, and I hate playing them because the games just take way too long. So I built my attempt at a pretty aggro, at least what I think is probably a good um, aggro empire list. Um, so yeah, this is it. If y'all want to take a screenshot or whatever, uh, <laughs> hopefully the deck list is going to be in the description this time, but yeah, we might, uh, we might go until I complete the challenge or just whatever. Once I get uh, frustrated enough, um, tomorrow's video will probably be a bit more interesting. Uh, I probably won't be ladder grinding for it, but, um, cause I'm going to be playing a very terrible meme. And it's probably not going to work at all. Alright. So we got Sundaren. Or Sundaren. They, uh, they're already in the Apprentice. So they probably started off on uh, rank 9. And have already advanced this far. So, you know. Kudos to you. I used to <laughs> I used to have so much more time to play this like I would um, the first couple times I made legend I would like I would basically like already be at legend you right now or at least me. like uh, in the thief the within the first few days like definitely like within the first week I, I would be able to hit it but um, man. That's exactly what I didn't want you to play. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna do this. And uh, I like doing this because it's kind of a cute little combo. And I, I don't think Empire's gonna have too much to deal with this. They're generally also pretty aggro, unless it's like the um, uh, Ramp Rage, which it could be because they have Tree Minder. Yeah, that could be a problem. Feel the might of the Empire. Standing by. You fight like a child. Alright, we're gonna swing before we get him down. And we're gonna try to hope to like not give him a chance to get too much value out of this. I mean he's gonna be able to play the tree minder. Which I'm I'm assuming that's what he's gonna wanna go for. He's gonna wanna ramp up. But we're gonna have to like move really quick. I wasn't looking for trouble. Probably better if I stick to the field lane too. So that way he can't just like throw down a night shadow here. Night shadow or a uh, night talon lord. Cause then my response would have to be like, well, I can't let it drain. So I'd play something and then he would just rage and get it off. The water. Yeah, he's gonna he's gonna ramp a lot. There's kind of no way around it. Cut them 
down. I'll see you dead. Of course I'm on your side. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go all in. Did you hear that? Because he would kind of need the rage like right now to save himself, and this is not a good rage. Because he would only get two two creatures back, then he would go back down to uh, one magicka. But I'm sure, I'm sure he's got another uh, fucking deadly dragger to just wipe all this out. Because that would be my luck. But he's uh, he's thinking quite a bit here. Yeah, that does save him. I, will spill your blood. Another. I think. I will protect the oh, come on, dude. Rice I wasn't looking for trouble. Vile canker blossom. I'll take them with me. Alright, he uh, <laughs> he delayed me by a turn, but I, I think we still got it. That's eight. That's ten right there. So he has to address this. Alright, we still have eight damage. Drawing a divine fervor would be really awesome right now. Really hope that's what I draw next. I stand to serve. Probably won't happen. I draw power from these trees. Come on. I think Gavel's good enough. Found you. I'll take them with me. Cut them down. I'll see you. Dead. All right. We just need one more damage. Uh, what do I have on my top end? I do have Cliff Racers. I have Razumdar. Uh, what else is there? I mean, really, all he needs is like a couple guards and me to not draw a charge of any kind. He might not have it if it's taking him this this long to figure out. Oh, that's bad. Crap. Your death is my command. Give me divine forever now. <laughs> oh. Oh. By the aid of I know. I know the sky. Guide us. Canker I'll take them with me. Thank you, Todd Howard. <laughs> uh I probably shouldn't have won that. Yeah, I probably should not have. <laughs> I 
actually, I think I want to play like a control. <laughs> I actually think I kind of do. Oh, I'm now I'm gonna have to remember to put two of them. All right. I'm only putting one new era in because that card is fucking cancer. And also, same thing with guardians. I usually only use one or one of like these kind of cards. Uh, we'll do thorn hiss mages. We're gonna throw in some ramp in here. Reminders. Uh, so this is generally how I build my decks. Um, so I always throw in some. If I'm playing yellow, I always throw in some executes just in case there's a couple uh, invades. And then I'll even do something like. Kind of have to have golden initiates, but I'll throw in a couple of grizzly gourmets, and then some cloud resolutionist because. I feel like Cloud Rest Illusionist is actually really underrated. I don't see her a lot, but there's there's so few creatures that like have enough to like make execute like not work on them, like because they have to have more than six power, and really not a whole lot like has that much. Like even these these are like kind of really good late game cards, and they still don't have that like. Cards like Alien Guardians, Odiving, Parthenax, like those cards are immune to it. But at that point, you should probably just be holding on to a Javelin for them. Which, uh, speaking of which, Piercing Javelins. And we've got Nine Prophecies. Let's see what Prophecies I would want. Phalanx Exemplar is good, but I'm going to hold off just for a second on it. Uh, yeah, Fighter's Guild Recruit's alright. For, for a 3 attribute deck, I kind of try to keep it around 15 to 20 prophecies. I feel like that gives you a higher chance of pulling them when you need them. And then I'll, I'll generally make them a card like City Guard. Because it's already overstatted for it, or you know, it's it's good stats for a two cost, and it has guard. The prophecy is just a nice bonus. Yeah, so at that point, I'll probably just pick mummify. I have an idea for what I want this deck to be, and it's going to be really, <laughs> really fucking annoying. So I'm gonna throw in some hollow death priests just to limit the opponent's options, and. Um, Fitting with that theme. Where is she? We're gonna throw in a couple of these. By a couple, I mean all three. Now, when I start getting to this point, uh, yeah, I have like 37 cards in. Um, even in control decks, it's really important to have a lot of two costs that are gonna kind of help you. Uh, at the very least, just stay alive uh, if you're going up against aggro. Because I see a lot of control decks where, like, they don't do anything for, like, four turns. And it's because all they do is, like, run, like, just everything that just blows everything up. Or, you know, like, just the big obnoxious cards. I don't know what I'm trying to say there. But, yeah, they run stupid stuff like that. And they wonder why aggro will beat them down. And it's because you can't do anything for the first few turns. Um, so Thieves Guild Recruit is also nice just to draw some cards. Pharaoh Stalker is very good for slowing down aggro. Might consider a Wind Keep Spell Sword, but let me look at these. Yeah. Uh, 
Uh, we'll do one keep spell sword, and I like it because kind of like uh, it doesn't have the same stats as like city guard, but it has a ward, so it's it's gonna defend pretty well. And now we do need some four costs. Actually, Bleak Coast Troll is pretty good. I mean, I guess I could throw in a couple of those groves. I won't throw in that many. I want some stuff that's actually going to kind of have some good value. Yeah, Edicts, Ember's Blade. Alright. Uh, five costs. Uh, bring off. I think we might. Yeah, we need some drain. So let me keep an eye out for that. Leaf Lurker is also pretty good. Torval Extortionist is actually also good. I'm going to throw in like two of those. I'm not really liking the curve right now. So I'm going to throw in some... S I'm going to throw in like a few six costs. I mean like it's not going to be as bad because there is ramp in the deck. I'm going to need, yeah, so the drain. I, I usually throw in one fresh start in a deck that has a lot of ramp because at a certain point it kind of doesn't matter that you're playing six magicka for three cards if you've ramped enough. And then, yeah, I think it's time to move on to uh, our finishers. Mirak is definitely going to be one of them. I'll throw in two Manticoras. Eclipse Baronesses are good. Alright, got two more slots. I'm actually going to use Hulking Scale on. And then... So then I'll take the deck and I'll look at it and I'll be like, okay, so it's kind of way too even, I think. So I would look at, okay, so like the five costs, I can maybe do without the Torval Extortionist, possibly. You know what? I'll leave it. This is also part of the deck testing. Sometimes you just kind of throw it together, see if it's gonna work. Oh shit! Nope, that's I didn't mean to do that. So we'll uh, take this control deck onto the ladder and see how it does. Pelinol White Strike. Love the name, my guy. Love it. Very lore friendly. Uh, this isn't a terrible hand. This is probably... You only ever see Ebonheart do like... Slay Ebonheart or Rage Ebonheart. So it's probably one of those. So maintaining control is going to be pretty important. Oh yeah, I did forget. I, I kind of touched on it a little bit, but um, I did make a Discord server that I'm also going to try to link. Oh, that's a nice pull. Uh, yeah, I made a Discord server that I'm going to try to link. Uh, I have a Facebook page. All, all the same name. Um, Vincenzo2k1n. For anyone who is interested. Alright, well, I think at this point I'm just going to execute that. Alright, that's pretty good. Uh, I'll do Bleak Coast Troll yet, or next. 
That's fine, dude. I will cut your purse. Uh, we do have the edicts, so I probably should have thrown in some shadow friends. I always forget about that card. I don't know why. Whenever, for some reason, whenever I think support removal, my mind goes to Dushnix and Belligerent Giants. Well, he hasn't played anything yet. So we'll see what he does here. Okay. Well, okay, interesting. I'm gonna try to finish this uh, quicker than he can get the his scrubs off. Because now he should be uh, trying to actually do something and he's not. Let me guess, got a crossbow? Yeah, same thing. Alright. So we're gonna lose the blades lookout. Or Emperor's Blade. Go no further. My scales move in shadow. Feel the power within you. Nobody breaks the law on my watch. I'll just do that. He's got a lot of cards, but uh it will take him quite a bit to have to get rid of this cleanly like he I mean like in theory he could just shift over Cicero with shadow shift and then do a rage but then he would overdraw like way too many cards or he could just keep moving back and forth with like crossbows and archers gambits and stuff like weird stuff like that they dare face the blade mistress of Balin <laughs> Nothing through. Close ranks. Stop right there, criminal scum. Where you stand. Shall we put in a dishonest day's rest? I've been killed since I was sixteen. The hiss shall heal you. I smell. All right, this is getting annoying. This is the problem. This is what happens when I don't play for a couple days. Yeah, whatever, dude. I'm, I'm not gonna sit here and let him... I'm not gonna sit here and wait for him to ramp to fucking, like, a million Magicka. Alright, we're gonna go back to the uh, aggro one. This is why I don't like playing control. I don't play control well. Zach with an H. All right, let's see it. Okay, for a second I was like, wait a minute. But I remember I had an inspiring soldier in in the uh, in the aggro one, not the uh, control one. I thought I made a, a whoopsie. Feel the might of the Empire. Standing by. Just in the nick of time. I'm more powerful than you can imagine. Alright, we're gonna go off to a very intense start against them. That's actually totally fine. Of course. <laughs> of course. I'll lend you my support. 
Why wouldn't that happen? Cut them down. Powers of fever. You're so sweet. I can just eat you up. <laughs> kind of sucks losing the uh, recruiter, but I think having Dawnbreaker is going to make up for it. Yeah, living. it definitely is. They will not get past okay. Me. All right, he's he's getting really nice guards and shit. <coughs> this should help. All right, man, whatever. <laughs> whatever, man. Cut them down. Die, craven fool. Wait. Did you hear that? I'm going to do this just to protect some of the damage that I have. And then I'm probably going to play Hafinger, uh, Marauder. I'm not sure who I'm going to swing with first, though. You cannot. It might depend on if uh, I can keep Haunting Spirit alive before I start attacking. I don't trust that one bit. No, he can't rage for a while. Well, that's lame. Powers of feet, cut them down. Scrumptious. I'll take them with me. That should do it right there. There's uh, not too much you can do to answer that. I, th except for Dark Seducer. That would be the worst. Yeah, I think I win. The moons give this one strength. Zeus. <laughs> Them down. I'll see you dead. Die, Craven. I'll fool. take them with me. I'll try to draw their fire. All right, just in case there's going to be some stupid rage shenanigans happening here. I think there are. I am too sleep for you. Guard, of course. Just in case there isn't, he just he just had to get guard. <laughs> just to make it that much more annoying. Oh, he's just going to try to draw a bunch of cards. And fortunately, I th that should be it. Come on. Wow. This is why I hate playing at the start of the season. It has nothing to do with that, but... <laughs> oh my god, dude. <sighs> what are the fucking odds? this time dude what the fuck is this hand <laughs> the only I'm pretty sure I only own two of these guys and of course I draw fucking both of them this early 
I feel like my luck at the beginning of really and then a four cost. I want to be an assassin. I feel like my luck at the beginning of the season is always just like the worst. I smell the stench of the living. Of course I'm on your side. Alright, dude. Do your worst. Wrong place for a midnight stroll. I will keep Sota Sil's people alive. Watch, he's gonna get immediate value off of that. A little distraction might prove useful. <laughs> Training is over. The it's North time must to act. take back Skyrim. Just so you can get the guard on your side? Is that what you're gonna do? For Ulfric Storm. Okay, no. Alright, for sure a half and girl marauder's gonna come down. Do you not fear me, mortal? I really can't stand this game sometimes. The battle is yours. All right, I'm gonna take a <laughs> a break and I'm gonna be right back because I'm getting pissed off right now. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm back this time, and. I'm going to say screw this daily challenge because <laughs> I actually really hate playing Empire. Um, but I can definitely summon 30 creatures to the shadow lane. So I'm just going to play something totally different. Um, Don't know what to play though. You know what? I'll use some more of the the Skelly Boys. They seem to put in some good work. <sighs> Sometimes. <laughs> <clears throat> Yeah, <laughs> I really hate playing at the beginning of the season because everyone who made Legends in rank 5 and it's just so hard at the beginning. I feel like they, they put on their sweatiest decks so that way they can get to Legend like ASAP. And I just, tr I just try to have fun and make weird shit. Well met, Marsh friend. Alright, Chuck Norris. Kind of a very, um, this isn't what I would imagine Chuck Norris actually looking like. You know, if I was just going off the name alone, it's not a very good representation of him. Alright, well, I'm just going to kill that. Because I don't want to deal with that guy getting like really big for no reason. You will feed my clan. Hey, we're gonna play Skeletal Dragon. Cause he's not doing very much. By the fires of oblivion. Alright, we're gonna get our blood magic spell. You will feed my clan. And we're 
probably gonna draw Bone Colossus now. Uh, likely play him on the next turn. Drain Life is very good. But I'm probably gonna play him on the next turn. And... Ooh, Training Grounds too. Uh, I kinda have to do Training Grounds. Now I kind of have to get rid of that. <laughs> At least his hands full. He's he's burning a lot. Yeah, so I didn't get to show this off when my wife was playing, but this starts making all the uh, skeletons a lot harder to deal with. He doesn't have an Atronaut, though. I swear to god, dude, if he has a Dawn's Wrath after I do what I do. Or after <laughs> I do what I plan on doing, I should say that it sounded weird. An Ice Storm would also be pretty bad. But if I can go one turn without there being an Ice Storm. Or a Dawn's Wrath, I'm good. Come on. I kind of don't care about that. By the egg, a fine battle. Yeah. I feel like games with this deck. Uh, kind of get out of control really fast for the opponent if they don't know how to deal with it. Or if they can't, because Mage doesn't have any good support removal. All they have is uh, Dismantle and Vicious Drag, which are not very good cards by themselves. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess I might as well keep this. Uh, I'm doing something a little strange here. But I think I have an idea of what I might do with this if they play something. Come on, then. Entertain me. Okay, it's just orcs. Alright.
<clears throat> now, what am I most worried about them running? I think Miss Gark and Lich. Um, Welcome, friend. That can be potentially very annoying for them to have to deal with. You get one shot. Make it good. Yeah, whatever, dude. So he's gonna want to keep that guy alive. I don't know why this card just annoys the hell out of me. I I've had games where they just draw like all three of them, like back to back, and they just like pile on one one of my guys. That shit's really annoying. Yep. We scan you nice. Of course. <laughs> you waste my time. Steal and go. Probably not a bad idea to get rid of one of these. I think this might start slowing them down. We must protect our stronghold. Never mind. You waste my time. Come at me. Alright, we're gonna not give them any cards. I think I lost already. Of course. <laughs> of course. Like, right when I needed to actually start trading with their stuff. Of course. Ah, oh, dude, whatever. Alright, we pretty much wanted to get as much value out of training grounds as we could. And I think we got good value. This lane is probably we a bit unbeatable for him right now. Alright, gargoyle's pretty nice. No one gets through by the first board. Fortune fair. Now, see how an orc lord <sighs> Dude, fights. Of course. I 
need a little bit more than a gargoyle right now. <laughs> You will feed my Come on, give me a good blood magic spell. Give me a good one. Yeah, alright, dude. What the fuck ever? <laughs> you get one shot. Make it there he one. is. The battle is yours. <sighs> what ever? <laughs> I don't actually get that mad, I just get really annoyed. Alright, cool, we got that challenge. Let me go back to the aggro veteran. Let me do that. The, these videos are now just going to devolve into me attempting to play one deck and then just getting frustrated and just switching to a bunch of random shit. That's what's just going to start happening now. I guess the dagger's good. I don't know. These are both kind of terrible picks for what I want to do. Did I stutter or something? I will push them back. All right, so they're probably a burn deck. Well, I did want to give this guy the uh, Daedric Dagger. Actually, here's what I'm going to do. There we go. Now he can't just fucking lightning bolt something. Dark Rift, really? No one plays Dark Rift. Alright, just because I don't want that to happen. Alright, I think we got it. Some really stupid shit would have to happen for them to win, like right now. Hardly worth my time. I'll clear a path. You have met your end. Nice. 
I'm just gonna play with something until it loses. If the game like <laughs> that I lose on is annoying enough, I'll switch. There are. Oh man, I'm about to sneeze. Mm. Okay. Well, there are times though where I'm actually like, like I'll lose and like, okay, that was a good game. Other times, I get really frustrated. <laughs> I mean, no one likes losing, but you can't win them all. I th I think I'm okay with this. I think Iliac Sorcerer and Rapid Shot are kind of a possible funny combo. play him first because he always seems like a really unassuming card. Die, Craven Fool and Arcade Spear. This day will be mine. I stand behind my work. Uh that's not very good though. Alright, if he doesn't give this an item, then I'm just gonna wipe him out. Never mind. Confound you! Talking! Mudcrab! Merchant! Read my lips! The mouth bomb! Uh, she's actually probably a lot. First, first turn, dude. Okay. Anyway, as I was saying, she's probably better because I can start swarming. I can start adding stuff into this lane to start pressuring them a little bit. Like, not a lot, but I think any little bit will help. I don't just know how to make them. Well, that's terrible. Can't keep up with me. Die, Craven fool. I have no fear of you, cowardly fever. Taste my claws. Alright, well that <laughs> that did more damage than the five health he's gonna gain. So hopefully that's good. I swear to God, if he has an ice storm, don't have. That would mean that he drew that like within the first few turns. Okay, so he's just gonna drain for a lot. Cool. Cool, man. Cool. Come on, chop chop. By the fires of oblivion. I don't have a lot of time to play this game unlike most of you people. I can't spend five minutes waiting on you guys every game to play our turns. I, I think that more than makes up for the health that he just gained. Nothing like a good battle. Can't keep up with me, dry skin. Face me, milk drinkers. Hold the line. 
Ooh, that's a bad one to burn. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a rough one. I would hope that now he recognizes the danger that he's probably in. Again, all right. Really? Same dude? Your death will be sweet. Come on, give me some, like, usable damage. Is that a lightning bolt? Oh, yeah, of course. You can just fucking do that. <sighs> if you didn't shackle this guy, if you didn't shackle this guy on that last one, I probably could have done something. <sighs> I, need to, I need to settle down a little bit. Just don't know what I can play right now. All right, I feel like being a jerk. All right, so this deck is a Stealer of Secrets OTK deck. It's actually not terrible against aggro, but it's very slow because you spend the whole game nuking the whole board and just stopping your opponent from doing anything. The only thing it suffers against is other control. And I s it's Empire, of course, as soon as I switch. <laughs> I was gonna say, I've been going up against like other aggro and uh, mid range, so this should work. And then of course I go up against a uh, Empire, and it's probably gonna be control with Guardians, which alien Guardians like I almost never have an answer for that. <sighs> so watch this game take forever and not go anywhere. What have we here? Alright, um Let's just see. This will be my stress test. If this guy gets executed, it's probably control. Well, there's our stealer. Okay. You will die where you stand. Yep. Makes sense. It's Speak, probably control, which is not what I wanted. They probably. They probably have all their, um, can't think of the name, the Death Priest, Hollow Death Priest. So sweet. I can just eat you. <coughs> I'm sure they do. Because every single one of these is probably going to get transformed. such a waste of a javelin. I, like, I don't think javelining something small like that is really ever necessary. In, in my humble opinion. Walk with our Lord. I hate this card so much. <laughs> I 
I use it occasionally. But this card just, like, to me, screams, I have no girlfriend. I don't go outside. I don't touch grass. Made a deck faster if you want to battle. This one will get what it is. Thank God for this. Scrumptious. Don't have a uh, two cost that I can play there. Uh, Alright, it's not that bad if I play this, since he can't really draw a card. There we go, now I'll draw. Of course, don't have any of my javelins. Why would I ever draw those when I need them? You fight like a There is a toll for this road. I need like three really big dumb creatures that I can throw in that oh my god dude I'm not <laughs> I'm not dealing with this shit see these are the kind of control decks that I was talking about earlier when I was talking about the Empire they did nothing just about they did nothing and then bam this guy dark seducer odiving immediately into a soul tear just to get this guy back like what is the point Ugh, dude this is gonna take fucking forever this is probably gonna be the last one just cause I already know this is gonna take forever There are cards that I should be able to draw that will assist me. If I can get some of my cast in the times, that would be great. Well, there's one. We must protect our stronghold. I'm gonna need to save the cast in the times though. Cause I know I know a fucking Parthenax is gonna show up. I can't wait to see that guy. They're in my sights. Oh, let's do this. I have some old oh. oh. All right, a jab isn't too bad. What have we here? I'm gonna just delete that dude again. Scrumptious. I smell the stench of the living. I 
I will keep Sota Sil's people alive. Gee, I wonder what he picked. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I can't help myself. Ooh, right into the third jab. How many executes has this dude used? Just two. You must be cleansed. Wow. All right. This one will get what is needed. will get what is needed. <laughs> nice. I was just trying to get him to burn cards for a while. He kept having just enough to squeak by. Go on. <laughs> Kill him with Cicero. You won't. I yet surrender. Okay, yeah, fair enough. Is there singing in the boy? This one will get what is needed. But too bad. So sad. That puts me right there. What turn are we on? 26? By the aid, a sign. This one will get what is needed. Time to fight. My enemies have told me well. Dead men tell no lies. Wow. That wasn't as long as some of my other games with that deck have gone, so. That wasn't too bad, uh, but I've probably been recording for like at least an hour, probably an hour and a half. So I will check y'all out or catch y'all next time. Um, I'm going to link my Discord server, Facebook, all that stuff in there. So check that out if you want to meet some other cool people. Uh, a lot of them are probably going to come from uh, Schwartz's server as well. So yeah, hope to see y'all there. Y'all have a good day.